Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Sun, Moon and Rising Cancers. Um, this is the month of August. I want to say to you guys, thank you so much. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your likes and shares. Thank you for leaving a message behind. Thank you so much for your help. And I want to say to each and every person, this is going to be a water month, so it's going to be a good month for you. Um, good energies are coming through whatever uh, situation that you have been going through it is going to come to an end and this is very positive the month of August is going to be the month of the hermit the month of the hermit is when we look within inside to see who we are and to try to change our energy vibration to a positive one so it's going to be good because with the energy of the hermit it's a spiritual month where you're going to be trying to um, vibrate at the high energy vibration, seeing what you have done, looking at it and seeing that you need to make changes in your life. And this is going to be good. Um, in the beginning of the month, we have the energy of fire. The last part of the month, we have the energy of the hurt, which is bringing balance. So, um, you guys have so much major arcana, which the others haven't gotten. So um, the universal angels are saying to you is that you need to make changes in your life. Whatever changes you need to make in your life, uh, you have to make these changes because uh, you are seeing that changes need to be made in your life. The first week we have the earth energy. The second week we have the energy of love, which is your week. The second week, we in the third week, we have the tower. And the fourth week, we have justice. And the fifth week, week we have your own energy vibration of the energy of the moon so that is an intuition moon and this is going to affect the men okay let me look at your number energy vibration and we have twice the tower so that's going to be 16 the first number and then we have um, the number 10 and then we have um, the moon which is uh, the moon which is 18 so this is going to be a good month we have eight also two times so again we have eight we have 18 we have 16 we have 10 and the number seven Wow so seven eight 10 16 and 18 so there's a lot of numbers for you guys in this month whatever is happening um the energy of uh, um temperance is going to be your the outcomes of this month for you the energy of temperance is going to be the outcomes of this month for you so this is going to be good wow as we go and we look at the months in depth weeks in depth we have the energy vibration of temperance which is the energy of the virgos and there is going to be a, a, a triumphant and a success a triumphant whatever that has been taking place in your life is going to finally come to an end so there's a lot of movement and whatever that was happening in your life is going to finally come to an end you're going to be victorious with whatever situation that was taking place in your life there is going to be an ending a triumphant and a success and an end to whatsoever that was taking place in your life so that is a major arcana which is uh, the chariot and this is good because when the chariot comes in in the beginning of month you're going in war but this um, is the end of a situation that you're going to be moving to someplace something better in your life the second week is going to be good because you have the energy vibration of your own energy vibration in the second week of the lovers this is going to be good and you have the energy of the tower the lovers on the tower so for some people it's going to be the end of your relationships so again um, if you have been in a relationship that is not uh, positive there is going to be an end to your relationship it's going to end okay so whatever relationship that you're in expect that there is an ending coming in and this energy of the tower ending your relationship is from the universe that means the universe comes in to bring an end in because you didn't want to end this relationship and it's going to bring a, 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 a ending in your relationship 
third week we also have the energy of the tower which is that week and we have justice okay so whatever that has been happening if there was a divorce or whatever that was happening um, justice come in and bring an ending so there is going to be changing in the, your position so if you were going to lawsuit and that sort of a thing you're going to see that it comes to an end it comes now to an end and there is going to be transformation there is going to be changes coming up in your life as we look at the fourth week we have the energy vibration of justice the energy of justice comes with the daughter of the ones whatever the situation um, was with um, the daughter of the ones that is an Aries a scar a, 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 a Leo or a Sagittarius whatever it is and you had a legal system with it it's going to come it's going to be balanced out and your spirit guides and angels are going to be working in your um, side on this so whatever the situation was with and it has to do with a Sagittarius a Aries or um, a Leo this justice came in and this justice that came in is your universal angels of orchestrate a way to bring justice once and for all as we look at the fifth week we have your own energy vibration coming up so it's good for you cancers in this month of August because it's you're vibrating in the energy of water and this is good because a lot of endings a lot of clearance a lot of blockages are been moving and you have the seven of ones whatever the situation was you are um, ill in this situation so let's say you were a woman and you're with a man that is um, in a relationship for a very long time and it hasn't been going good you are protected against this man whoever he is you are protected against this man for some people if you are a man and your intuition is going to be very high and your spirit guides are going to protect you so if you are a woman you are protected against a man that you were having a situation with and it's come to an end if you are a man what is happening is that your intuition is going to become very high so this is a positive thing because you cancers have been going through a lot of situations and you need to have temperance in this week what it, month whatever is going on in this month you need to have temperance I want to say to you guys that um, whatever is happening in the middle of the month because we have five weeks in this month please go back please 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 go back and look at the reading so at the third we go back and listen again to this reading because there is going to bring out more information and you're going to see what the first two weeks of the months do and what the first two the last two weeks of the months is going to do so for you cancers whatever situation that you are going through you're going to be moving away out of that situation ends are coming in um, for you guys who are in relationship there is no energy of love for you guys it's all about ending certain situations that has been going on in your life new part new do doors are opening up for you knee changes needs to be happening um, for the people who have kids who is of a fire sign um, Aries Leo's or Aries Leo or um, Sagittarius there is going to be an alien coming in with you and that situation that is going on okay so be aware and be awakened to this for the men in the last week it's going to be a week of intuition you need to work with your intuition whatever is going on in the last week you need to work with your intuition um, but your relationship whatever relationship you had it's going to end in the second week as we move forward and we look at the sun sign let's see what's coming out for the sun sign cancers what is coming out for the sun sign cancers what is coming out for the sun sign cancers okay 
for the sun sign cancers what is going to affect you is the planet of Uranus and the planet of Uranus is always uh, making you be aware and awaken to uh, your the, the spirit guides and the spirit world and intergalactic family and the soul family so be aware of what is going on because Uranus whenever Uranus come in that means changes needs to come you're going to be have to be dealing with the scorpions and this the Scorpios and this is going to be good because they are going to teach you certain aspect of yourself and that you see certain aspect of yourself that you weren't aware of and you also have to deal with the Capricorns and the Capricorn energy is a good energy because they're very psychic and they're going to help you to move certain things and change certain aspect of yourself so for you fire sign people you have the planet of Uranus that is going to work in your in your um, energy vibration you have um, Scorpio and you have Capricorn that is coming in as we move forward and we look at the energy for the moon people the lunar people the moon people let's see and um, ask my angels and guides to show me what um, you can just need to look at for the moon Pluto is coming in my god that is going to be something and the Virgos are here and Jupiter so luck is coming in for you guys so that is good so for the moon people we have Pluto when Pluto comes in it's going to be an upsetting time because Pluto is coming in to show you things that you need to be aware of and show you a side of you who you weren't aware of so this is going to be a positive endeavor then who you're working with you're working with the Virgos and they are going to help you to bring balance and help you with the intuition side of who you are and the last planet is going to be Jupiter as so a Jupiter is coming in so this is going to be wonderful so for the moon people you have the energy vibration of Pluto and the Virgos and Jupiter and this is going to be a positive positive endeavor that is coming in the sign of Pluto and Virgo and Jupiter is going to come in and you're going to see these changes happening in your life so it's going to be wonderful positive changes whatever that is happening remember that Pluto um, um, Virgo and Jupiter is going to be working in your favor so it's going to be extremely extremely good as we move on we're using the energy vibration of the vortex and as I look here at your reading it's just plain and straight it is all about you moving forward in your life and ending certain things that no longer serve you and um, Pluto is going to come in to help you do that and um, the end of a relationship um, yes yeah, some people is not going to like that but whatever the relationship is it must be ended and then you your position is going to be changed um, it's the energy of justice comes in with a daughter of uh, the ones and the daughter of of the ones is always the energy vibration of an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius so we're looking at the last energy what do you have you have uh, attempting to control others attract more to be controlled Wow this is so um, profound attempting to attract to control others attract more to be controlled so this is saying a lot a lot to us because what this is saying is that attempting to control others um, more will attract more controlling for yourself it is easy to understand how you would come to the conclusion that your part to feel good is through influencing or controlling the behaviors of others but as you attempt to control them through influence or correct you discover that not only you not contain them but your attention to them bring more like them in your experience you simply cannot go to where you want to be by attempting to control or eliminate the unwanted this is perfect this is so so perfect so this is going to be your motto for this month learning that you cannot attend to control others because it's going to bring in more 
situation of people trying to control you too so you need to simply cannot get to where you want by to controlling others or eliminate unwantedness this is um, a positive 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 energy to leave you with and this is the card this is just so beautiful I so vibrate with these vibrational energy car and this is so wonderful remember what is your um, zodiac numbers remember that you can't learn to control other people and you need to find temperance in your life in this month so for each and every person out there I'm wishing you a wonderful wonderful September and I'm hoping the best for everyone out there and I want to say to you please like share these videos thumbs up I want to say thank you another time for the beautiful beautiful support that you have been giving me um, realize that we only can control what we are doing but try not to control others because uh, whenever you try to control others it's not gonna work out and I want to say namaste until next month